How much have puzzle sales increased? Oh, three or four hundred percent. I mean, they've always done well for sure, but lately because I mean, people are mandated to stay home. They're looking for something to do, and a puzzle is a great way, not only to chew up some time, but it's it's a kind of an interactive process that people are really into. Dr. Comics and Mystery Games says new comics have been extremely difficult to get because major publishers have had to halt shipments. That's why, at this store, puzzles have now risen to number one. I'm the kind of person, when I say I'm going to do something, I do it. I find it just a way to get away from the news and what's going on in the world. It's just a tangible thing that's more rewarding than a game which is somewhere out in the cloud and you do it, you accomplish it, but you don't have a physical reminder of what it was that you did. We now have like 12 hours that we have to keep the kids entertained. And this is one easy way where it is low tech, it's time with the family, and it takes their attention away from like, you know, something that is much more stimulating and glowing like, like, uh, like a screen is. I remember growing up doing the puzzle because I didn't have anybody to play with, but it's great now that I could be doing the puzzle with him because now we're spending time together and he's not on his own doing it and it's, uh, it's a bonding thing. It's fun and it's better than just doing it by yourself.